Hallelujah, glory to God. Shalom, family. I welcome each and every one in the name of Jesus. Amen. Father, we thank you for today, Lord. We give you praise. Lord, we thank you for your word that is about to come forth. I pray that everyone that is connected to this prophetic word, may you grant their heart desires in the name of Jesus. Lord, you said the entrance of your word brings light and understanding. I speak light into the lives of your people. I pray as they receive this word, may they understand every word that comes from my mouth in the name of Jesus. Amen. The seed, they no longer want you anymore. They say they no longer want you anymore. Hallelujah. Now, this is a specific prophetic word for someone. This person I'm talking to, when everything was going on well in your life, when things were going on smoothly in your life, you had friends and family members that were always around you. They were always around you because of the things that were benefiting from you. Right now, things are going down. A lot of financial difficulties. They no longer want you anymore and they have turned your backs against you. The Bible says in the book of Proverbs chapter 17 verse 17, A friend loves at all times and a brother is born for adversity. A true friend is the one that stands with you at all times, in the good times and in the bad times. When things are difficult for you, a true friend sticks around you. When things are going down for you, a true friend stands with you. Right now, because things are not going on well in your life, they have rejected you. They are no longer coming around you because they don't see anything to benefit from you. But the Lord says I should pray for you. The we is about to be a turnaround in the name of Jesus. Everything that the enemy stole from you, God is about to bring you back to the place where you used to be in the name of Jesus. I pray that God open your eyes to those who are pretending to love you. All these friends that were sticking around you when things were fine and they left you when things got bad. I pray God disconnect you from them in the name of Jesus. I pray God opens your eyes and connect you to good people. I pray God connect you to genuine friends and genuine family members in the name of Jesus. Amen. I hope you receive this word with gladness. Please do not forget to like, share, and subscribe. Also, turn on your notification bell so I never upload new content. You will be the first to know. I love you all so much, family. And see you in our next session. God bless you. Shalom.